Hello YouTube, Zaya187 here again for an updated version of how to load schematics into your Minecraft 1.13.2 server. Let's go ahead and get started and get our world edit files. I like to get mine here from Bucket still. I know it's kind of obsolete, but it still works quite well. So we're going to go here to the last version, 1.13. And download that into our plugins file. Alright, I'm already there. Um, sometimes you might have to go find where your server is. Mine is just in my gaming file, so it's quite easy to find. Now that that's done, we're going to go ahead and launch our server and load the files. This would be like your uh, run.bat or start.bat or launch.bat. I'm kind of a Star Wars freak, so therefore mine's Star Wars.bat. You can name it anything you want. I will also uh, include this uh, server right here, this exact server download, into uh, the YouTube description if you guys just want to download a server if you don't have one yet. It's loading it loads the world edit file here and our world edit dash bucket dash 7.0.0 beta looks like we're good to go let's find out and there's my server so let's go ahead and get the schematic in first I'm going to go to my planet Minecraft. And let's see, what are we going to put in? How about a random church in the world? God, I built this in 2013, six years ago. I don't know. Save that to my desktop, and then I'll show you where to put it. I'm just going to remain it just church, so it's a little easier to load in to the world. All right, exit out of my browser. Here's my schematic there, so we're going to go to the world edit file here and create a new folder called schematics. Open that file and plop our schematic right in there. Let's go ahead and go into game. You don't need to reload, refresh, or restart the server at all when you put schematics into the file. All right, we're going to randomly teleport somewhere in the world. Perfect. And to place it into the world, you're just going to type in the command slash slash schematics load mc edit and then the name of your schematic.
and slash slash paste to paste it into the world. And there it is. Looks like uh, I didn't get the stairs in that. But that's okay. Here's the church. Let's see if I got the basement. And it is that simple.